in 2020, amidst a world looking for an escape, a novel by a new author hit the shelves and instantly captivated readers. The Thursday Murder Club took everyone by surprise, becoming a global sensation. But who is Richard Osman, the man behind this unexpected hit? How did a TV quiz show host become one of Britain's favourite crime writers, crafting mysteries that blend humour, wisdom and the thrill of the unknown? Join us as we delve into Richard Osman's story, his path to becoming a novelist and the secrets behind the charming world of the Thursday Murder Club. Early Life Richard Osman was born in 1970 in Essex, England, to a family that fostered creativity and wit. His father left when he was just nine years old, a tough experience that shaped his sense of independence early on. Raised by his mother, who encouraged his interests, Osman found solace in books, particularly those that allowed his mind to wander into worlds beyond his own. Even as a child, he was drawn to storytelling, and his sharp wit became apparent. Osman's height, he stands at an impressive six feet seven inches, made him stand out, and his keen intelligence set him apart. But despite his love for stories, he didn't initially set out to be a writer. Instead, his path led him to Cambridge, where he studied politics and sociology, paving the way for his first career, the unexpected road to television. After university, Osman ventured into television, landing his first big break as a producer and later moving in front of the camera as a host. In 2009, he co-created Pointless, a quirky quiz show where contestants try to find the least obvious answers. The show became a hit and Osman's natural charisma made him a favourite with audiences. His unique blend of intelligence and humour won over fans who loved his warm but sharp wit. But Osman's interest in crime stories was always lurking in the background. When he wasn't hosting or producing, he would dive into mystery novels, savouring the thrill of unravelling puzzles. However, he still had no idea that one day he would create a mystery of his own, let alone one that would take the world by storm. The spark of inspiration for the Thursday Murder Club. Years of solving puzzles on Pointless had only sharpened Osman's natural curiosity, but it was a visit to his mother's retirement community that sparked the idea for the Thursday Murder Club. He imagined a group of retirees using their sharp minds and unique life experiences to solve cold cases. What if, he thought, these elders pulled their skills to crack real mysteries? From that spark, the characters of Joyce, Elizabeth, Ron and Ibrahim were born, four residents of a peaceful retirement village with a penchant for murder mysteries. What made this book different from typical thrillers was Osman's signature humour and deep empathy for his characters. He didn't just write a crime novel, he wrote a story about friendship, ageing and the mysteries of life. When The Thursday Murder Club was published in 2020, readers fell in love with these four amateur detectives and their unconventional methods. The book flew off the shelves, and Osman became an overnight literary sensation. Challenges of Sudden Fame With the success of his debut novel, Richard Osman faced an unexpected challenge, balancing his life in television with his new role as a best-selling author. He quickly followed up with sequels, including The Man Who Died Twice and The Bullet That Missed, further cementing his place in the literary world. However, fame in the literary scene comes with its own set of pressures. Osman was now recognised not just as a TV host, but as a serious author with a devoted fan base. Fans expected more books, and the demands on his time grew. He's spoken candidly about the pressures of fame and the importance of mental health, acknowledging that the transition wasn't always easy the heart of the Thursday Murder Club. What makes the Thursday Murder Club so special? Many fans agree that it's the unique blend of humour, warmth and mystery that Osman brings to the page. In a genre often dominated by gritty thrillers, Osman's books are refreshing, offering a glimpse into the lives of characters often overlooked in literature, retirees, Osman captures the spirit of these older characters with respect and authenticity. 
instead of portraying them as merely elderly or frail, he shows their strength, wit and resilience. Joyce, Elizabeth, Ron and Ibrahim are full of life, with all their quirks, strengths and vulnerabilities, making them some of the most relatable characters in modern crime fiction. Osman's views on ageing and mystery writing. In interviews, Osman often touches on how he sees mystery novels as a metaphor for life's puzzles. He believes that every individual, regardless of age, has unique insights and skills. Through the Thursday Murder Club, he shines a light on the wisdom and wit that come with age, challenging stereotypes of older people. This viewpoint resonates with fans of all ages. His stories remind readers that life remains full of mystery and adventure, no matter the age. Osman shows us that the human experience is rich with humour, resilience and secrets, even in the quietest of retirement communities, the legacy of Richard Osman. Richard Osman's impact on literature is only beginning, though he's relatively new to the literary scene. His success with the Thursday Murder Club has paved the way for a whole new subgenre. Mysteries that don't rely on shock value or violence, but instead celebrate community, friendship and wit. With more books and even adaptations on the horizon, Osman's career as an author is only set to grow. His characters have struck a chord with readers worldwide and he's inspiring a new generation to see mysteries through a more light-hearted, hopeful lens. The Charm of Richard Osman Richard Osman's journey from TV to books may seem unexpected, but perhaps it's just another twist in the grand puzzle of his life. Through his warmth, humour and respect for his characters, he's created stories that don't just entertain, they connect us. He's shown us that life's mysteries don't always need to be dark and disturbing. They can be funny, moving and surprising. And perhaps that's the real magic behind Richard Osman. The ability to bring people together through a shared love of stories, no matter their age or background. What's your favourite Richard Osman book so far? And who would you cast in a movie adaptation of The Thursday Murder Club? Let's get a casting debate going in the comments.